That's when it's my favorite. It makes your eyes twinkle. Does it now? Half price if you buy two. Wow. You again. Is this your store? <laughs> no. My father's. How much? 800 rupees, please. 800 rupees? Okay, okay for you, 550. Incredible. So, does your father usually leave you here alone? No, he's away fighting the devils. Oh. The Indian Army called him up, did they? No, he volunteered. Really? Well, if it was my choice, I wouldn't leave you here alone. All right. That's 300. Bet the deal. 400 rupees plus Ganesh. <laughs> you don't want this. It's broken. See? You don't know the story? Ganesh fought Parashuram while standing guard at his father's door. Yes, to defend the honor of his father, Shiva, and got his tusk hacked off for his troubles. Hmm, interesting. Anyway, it's not for sale. <sighs> right on time. Okay, look, 600 rupees. You can keep the change. Hey, wait! You need the guy. Oh? And what'll that cost me? <laughs> My sister needs me. How am I supposed to get it tonight? Need to be on that truck before it goes. Oh. So you're Ganesh. How much for it? Really? Not for sale. <clears throat> what? Don't get me wrong. Decent technique on the lift. But I'd like my Ganesh back. Please. <sighs> Fine. A for effort, kid. A tourist, are you? Looks okay. Hello, lady. Great prices. Thank you. We're busy here. Oh, I've already got what I need. Thanks. Do you work for CIA? Because that would be very cool. People aren't allowed across the bridge. It's too dangerous. Listen, kid. It's been really fun. You need to make yourself scarce. I have a spare bed in the store. 300 rupees. Best deal in all of India. Oh. Okay, no thanks. I need to get on this truck. Bad idea. The rebels, they hurt people. Listen, I need to help my friend, okay? Tell you what, when I get back, pizza's on me. Deal? Deal.
red door. That's it. Better than nothing. Here we go. It's just an active war zone. Nothing you can't handle. your rash how do i know you're not smuggling something in here arms up hey it's dangerous to be out so late hey where do you live what are you deaf answer him i said where do you live i love this one i'm in the middle of something uh, yes, sir. Meet me inside. Understood. You, with me. Man the gun. Sir, what about her? Just let her through. You heard him. Get going. Lucky for them, I've got somewhere to be. Red door. Check. Now this way. Almost. There's a couple more in the alley. Great timing. Moving out tonight. Pink Lotus. The hell does that mean? that for much longer. <laughs>
These two targets. One was the warehouse, the other. <sighs> You're in the wrong place, girl. Relax. You'll live longer. Relax? It took me weeks to track down a soft. The man's as unpredictable as they come. He's just another warmonger with no war to fight. No, you don't know him like I do. He changes location and routines by the hour. We'd be foolish to take unnecessary risks. We? Let's get one thing straight. This is my gig. You want your share? We play by my rules. What's it gonna be? He's the one with the beard. That's the spirit. Mm. Handsome. If you're into psychopaths. Nobody's perfect. Where's base camp? Top floor balcony. A street route all planned out, but they'll be looking for us now. What do you suggest? I'll think of something. Come on, I'll give you a boost up. <sighs> there you go. Thank you. Now what? Patience. Up here. Really? Really. Careful on this one. You sure this is safe? No. We're moving away from a soft den. Yeah, we're taking the long way. Now I'll see why you're always late. I'll take them off. Cobra 1 to Cobra 5, over. Received Cobra 1. Hit 
That's where we need to be, but not getting through here without a blowtorch. So, now we improvise. I thought that's what we were doing already. Just exploring our options. Sit tight. about that. How about we avoid crates from now on? <laughs> okay, okay, good deal. <gasps> no, no, no! For supplies, if you want them. You always this company on the job. Yeah. So just take a moment. There's one. <laughs> oh, that works. Let's find that disc. Thank you very much. Watch our backs, yeah? Yeah. He's been a busy boy. How much do you think it's all worth? Enough to keep his little insurrection going for quite some time. Promising. It's locked. Not for long. What was that map? Western Ghats, Hoysala territory. Shit. No, it's all right. Nothing we didn't already know.
Time to go. Nadine Ross. What a pleasant surprise. Ah, ah, careful, brothers. This tiger's got claws. A soft. Oh, all these years. And you haven't aged a day. You too can't. <laughs> Are you looking for work? I hear that Shoreline's under new management. Temporary setback. Nothing I can't handle. Of course, of course. Pity though. My men and I could use someone of your caliber. This isn't your area of expertise. It, it is a nice collection, I must say. Chloe Fraser, collector of antiquities. A thief? You're working for a thief. Sir, we have a situation. <gasps> what? I'll be right there. The disc. Oh, right. About that. At first, I mistook you for just an average rebel. Oh. But you have managed to find the Hoysala Empire. That's not bad. Their greatest treasure. The Tusk of Ganesh. Now that's not an easy find. What are you doing? Three Persian invasions. Three separate wars, and all these years later, no one has found it. We're close. You're lost. And the only chance you have of even narrowing down its location is to find someone who can help you... ...crack this artifact. Someone with an extensive knowledge of Hoysala society. Exactly. Mm. An expert in their culture and history. My rates are reasonable. A parasite who exploits our struggle in order to fatten her pockets. Hmm. So that's a no? Felt like a no. <laughs> You've got balls. I like that. But I don't need any more so-called experts. Shoot them. Throw their bodies in the river. No need. We'll throw ourselves out! Oh, after them! Through the window! My hammer! Get them! Oh, shit! Come on! We need to get across the river! Messy, but effective. You were going to sell me out, weren't you? It's called improvisation. God, who's being unprofessional now? What the hell is that supposed to mean? It means you let Asav get the jump on us. I'm starting to wonder whether you're worth the 50%. I knew it. You were going to give me up. Guess a leopard can't change her spots. You know nothing about me. Fair warning. Last person who betrayed me wound up dead. There's your river. Yeah? And your guy better be there. Shit! Yeah, well, time to go! Oh, 
going out there. On schedule. Should hit land in about an hour. Great. The tusk of Ganesh. No wonder the whole solar capital was ransacked. Look at this thing. Any luck? I don't need luck. I'd say we can use all the luck we can get. Are you still hung up on a Sarv's so-called expert? Don't worry. If a Sarv's not in the gets already, he'll be right on our heels. Plus, he's got weapons, transport, hundreds of men. Like I said, don't worry. <gasps> Looks like some kind of key. Maybe. Let's see. Okay. The trident was Ganesha's weapon. The bow and arrow was Parashurama's. And the axe. The great battle. What? The battle in which Ganesh lost his tusk. I bet we find these symbols. We find the tusk. Not bad, Fraser. Yeah, well. You like my dad for that. Hindu myths were his thing. Might have rubbed off. He must be proud. Sun's almost up. I'll go get ready. Nice work. Settle an argument. Just for my peace of mind, all right? <laughs> well, nice view. And look. How weird. I'm sorry I doubted you, Chloe. Is her Salah? Hoi Salah. It's not a modern structure, so we're definitely on the right track. What? I don't like it. You don't like anything? No. We've gone nearly a hundred kilometers with no sign of a sov. Glass half full, maybe we got the jump on them. Unlikely. I'll find the tusk. A salve's on you. 
Understood. Meet you back at the car? Yep. Ah, right where I left it. Amazing landscape. down there? Yep. Still here. Great. Just checking. Here, give me your hand. I'm good, actually. Okay. Want me to drop? Nope. I oh, don't mind. I do. It's a control thing. Sure. Let's just enjoy the serenity, shall we? Got a dumb question. So much for that. How do you know the tusk is still there? It would have turned up in a museum or something by now, right? Plus, I haven't seen any Hoysala exhibition. I've never even heard of Hoysala before this job. Yeah, well, that's the fault of their last king, really. Young, reckless, flaunted his empire's wealth, built a new capital to house the tusk and then led the Persians right to their doorstep. And now us? And now us. Hey, look, Flamingo Convention. Give me a second. I can wait. See your way forward? Looking.
anything. Could have warned me. Well, where's the fun in that? So, quite nice to be outdoors, isn't it? Away from the city. Quieter. You come back here often? No, not really. Oil the head, go down. Oh, look at this. Poisala ruins. Can we get through that gate? I'll check it out. The old capitals. What have we got? Halabadu and Valour. I thought these were Ganesh and Shiva. Hmm. Someone's been paying attention. Ganesh was the guardian of Halabadu, the newer of the Hoysala capitals. Shiva was the guardian of the former capital, Balor. Well, the stonework is beautiful. But this isn't much of a defensive wall. Hmm. Sculptor's quarters, by the look of it. We're still on the outskirts. Didn't take you for an archaeologist. That would be my dad, actually. I'm just a thief, remember? Hey, is the rental equipped with a winch? Looks that way. Oh, great. That'll make short work of these gates. What, you're just going to pull them down? That's the plan, unless you brought dynamite. This is your gig. Take that as a no. Should do the trick. Brother. Razor, move! It's an ambush! Shit! Take cover! Uh, thanks for the heads up! about to pull down an ancient gate. Yeah, I was. And there we go. You're awfully quiet. I'm just surprised is all. Figured you'd be more of a leave no trace type when it comes to Indian runes. Sentimentality in this line of work? Get you killed. They're just large flying rodents. Actually, no, they're not. Yeah, they are. They're closer to primates and lemurs. Okay, well, I'll look it up. Go, 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 go! Come on, come on. We've got some place to be. There we go.
well spotted. Shit. He's brought a whole battalion with him. Might even be more inside already. Hey, I'm flattered that he's taking us so seriously. We need to get through that gate. All right, we'll slow down. We gotta take care of these jokers first. You have a plan? Yeah. Sure. Here goes nothing. Any word from Cobra One? Patience. Either. Okay, you go that way. I will look this way. Be careful. Too close. Huh? 
Like I planned. <laughs> yeah. Let's get going. I'll get the gate open. Bring the car around? Sure. Thank you. This looks to be it. Driving, you know. I'm sure you are, honey. I just prefer to. Oh, it's a lot of ground to cover. True, but unlike your boy Asav, we've got an advantage. The three symbols. Let's have a look at the map. Okay, let's see. We are right about here. I can mark it up as we go. Check out that tower. Bet you could get the lay of the land from up top. Maybe. Keep an eye out for a soft. Perfect. Not that I'm too worried about him, though. You should be. We won't have the advantage of surprise again. Don't think he was expecting much from you. Wait, was that a compliment? That that sounded like a compliment. These guys are idiots, but a soft is. We just need to stay the hell away from him. Let's 
Never understood the appeal of people like Asav. Easy. He finds... Oh, hold up. Fraser, we've got company up ahead. their enemies. Careful, friend. I'm just telling the truth. Don't recognize this. It's not one of the three symbols. We should stay focused. Never say no to a chance to make some extra cash. Hmm. Huh. That wall looks fragile. Some kind of Hoysala token. It's not one of our three symbols. Might be worth trading once we get back home. After all that, you find anything? Just a token of some kind. Old Hoysala thingy. 
Think we need it? Need? Probably not. Want? Definitely. Hey, notice anything about this statue? It's holding a trident. One of our three symbols. Yes, and it's pointing at those ruins. Right. Well done. Glad I'm good for something. Understood the appeal of people like Asav. Easy. He finds men who are weak and offers them power. Gives them purpose. Purpose? Sounds more like bullshit to me. How'd you get tangled up with Asav anyway? Purpose? Rather not go into it. He certainly seemed to have a thing for you. Don't remind me. Proved useful at the time, but. Yeah. Well, rather not. Maybe over drinks? Not enough alcohol in the world. <laughs> right, you're the military expert. What's the Sav's strategy here? He spread out his men, hoping to stop us in our tracks. Not what I would do. So what would you do if you were a Sar? Besides lose the beard? Hang back? Let you do the heavy lifting, then swoop in and grab up the task once you've done all the hard work. Devious. Practical. Mitigates a lot of risks. Lucky you're on my team. Yeah, you are. I'm a little surprised Assad's not doing the same thing. Maybe his expert knows more than we think. Right. All the more reason to wrap this up quickly, then. Interesting circular motive. Like with this, we're definitely in the right place. No telling how many men are in there. You ready? Guess we'll find out. Not yet. Hey, waiting on Cobra Eight. Many men are in here. All of them. They're all in here. Let's keep this quiet as long as...